Now, Liverpool's hopes of a treble are officially over. They beat Atalanta 1-0 on the night in the Europa League quarter-finals, but it wasn't enough to overturn a 3-0 first-leg deficit in what is now Jurgen Klopp's last European game as the Liverpool manager. That's right, yeah. They made a great start, taking an early lead, but Mo Salah's seventh-minute penalty couldn't then inspire the kind of comeback that Liverpool have been known to uh, produce over the years. I'm disappointed that we didn't go through, but... Sorry, but not frustrated or angry or something like that. Now we can focus on the league and that's what we will do. We have a few days to recover. We'll do that and travel day after tomorrow to, <laughs> to London and we'll, um, we'll play full M, which will be tricky, but um, we will give our absolute all. That's our competition now. I saw a good reaction from my side. We had not a great week last week, obviously. This... Um, if he won't, was to start for the rest of the season with a good result and a good performance, and that's how we see it. I think we had chances, um, and I think um, you know, obviously, maybe we were a little bit in the rush. We want to score, we want to make the two 0 and um, but um, I think the damage and the problems that we had was already mm. done last week when we lose three 0 and mm. especially at home we were very bad. Mm. And um, now it's time to focus on the Premier League. Now, after the game, Klopp defended Mo Salah. You saw him miss that good chance there to make it 2-0. Yeah, it's fair to say Salah struggled a bit to find his top form since returning injured from AFCON in January. But Klopp was quick to dismiss any concerns about his forward. I'm not particularly concerned. That's what, that's what strikers do, that's what happens to strikers. That's how it is. We have to go through this. He has to go through that. He's the most experienced, one of the most experienced players we have in the squad. Uh, we will go through that, but um, that's pretty much all. It's not that Mo didn't miss chances before um, in his life. That's part of the game. Now, um, the penalty was super convincing. It was a super penalty, and then the next chance, obviously, that was um, unlucky, but it's not the first time that he missed a chance like that. So, Liverpool out. Atalanta will take on Marseille in the semi-finals. It's only the second time that Atalanta have reached the last four of a European competition in their history. The first time since 1988. Yeah, and their head coach, Gian Piero Gasparini, says beating Liverpool over two legs feels as good as winning a trophy, but he hopes his side can go on to create even more history. Don't you prove neanche. <laughs> non ci provo perché eh, diciamo che sono state due medaglie preziose, no? Poi non sono magari un trofeo, una coppa, ma delle medaglie di grandissimo valore e l'Atalanta ne ha un forziere di medaglie che forse valgono anche più di trofei e di coppe, poi speriamo di poter raggiungere anche una coppa, ma le coppe non sono molte, eh, quelle giocabili.